Hi everyone, welcome to Pentacool Math Mania. Today, we will be using math as our superpower to learn about tally charts. This is Ali. Ali is a fruit vendor who sells bags of chenet, mango, and pomerac. And Ali wants to use a tally chart to identify his best selling item. Ali uses a pen and paper and heads up his tally chart. In the left column, he lists the different fruits he sells. Each time he sells a fruit, he makes a mark or tally in the middle column next to the one he just sold. When Ali sells five of any item, the fifth tally would be written across the previous four. At the end of the day, these are all the tallies that Ali made while selling his items. Now, he must find the total frequency of each item by adding up the tallies made. Each tally with four vertical strokes, together with a diagonal stroke, is counted as five. So, for the chenet, Ali sold five plus five plus two, which adds to give 12 bags of chenet. For the mangoes, he sold five plus one, which adds to give six mangoes. Lastly, for the Pomerac, Ali sold just three. After Ali has tallied up all of his items, he wants to know what is his most popular item. Can you tell which item is most popular? If you guessed Chenet, then you are definitely correct. Now that Ali has figured out his most popular item, he wants to know what was the total number of items that he sold for the day. Pause for a moment and think about how this can be done. To find the total items sold, Ali must add up all the frequencies in the right column. So, if we add 12 plus 6 plus 3, we get a total of 21. This means that Ali sold 21 fruits that day. I hope you had fun learning with me today about tally charts. Try the Pentacle exercises below to earn points and win great prizes.